What's up, dudes? It's Molly. I'm here to bring you a channeled reading. Hi, I'm Molly. I'm a clairaudient psychic empath. Uh, anything I say is part of your message. I am channeling. Dudes! Yesterday sucked. Like, big. Like, big suck. Big suck. Like, a big sir. Okay. Yeah. I was so sick yesterday. It totally sucked. I was puking. My body was evacuating. <laughs> I changed vibrations. I ascended in vibration. I had like the, I had like, it was like the flu. It felt like it was shivery, sobby. Oh, there, my computer just turned off. Imagine that as soon as I start videotaping. There. Tarpon? A tarpon might mean something. As soon as I start video, it, videotaping, <laughs> the hackers turn my computer off while it's starting back up again. So, yeah, that really sucked. So, right now is my first coffee I've had. I didn't have coffee all day yesterday. I had ginger ale. Yeah. Oh my god, it tastes so good. I also have the frame. Yeah, we have the person who says, I want to put your picture in my frame. All right. This might be the person looking for an old-fashioned modern girl. All right. Somebody may go to someone's art studio. All right. Westfield, Massachusetts. Massachusetts might mean something. They might find a lovely image for their frame. All right. Okay, I just did this, and some cards flew up when I did this. Yeah. Mm, lemons might mean something. Somebody about to turn some lemons into some lemonade. All right, so here's what I have going on here. I have the Scorpio C. Tarot, Creativity of Life, Messages from Divine Feminine Showgirls, and Messages from the 80s, the Starseed Deck. And when I flipped up... Hello. <laughs> when I flipped up. Oh. I thought I wasn't recording. Hold on, am I recording? Okay, I was totally recording. <laughs> Clearly, I need more coffee. So when I flipped up, this is what I flipped up. Intuition. So when I flung that, my... Mm-hmm. A couple cards came flung along, along with them. Work it out. All right. So we're going to call names. Yeah. And each name is going to get four messages. A message from Scorpio C, a message from Creativity of Life, a message from the Divine Feminine Showgirls, and a message from the 80s, the Starseed Deck. All right. Here's... Yep, here's what happens when they shut down my computer. All right. Any names you see in here that you may resonate with, that means spirits working with these people or locations. I have over 2,100 re past readings. And when I type these names and, or locations in a search of a past reading of past readings up to the top five most current readings with that name in the title will pop up. I'm an activated star seed, and those are your star seed transmissions. So I'll read you those titles, and that'll be your storyline. All right, you guys ready? So we're gonna start, I can't type in names into the search quite yet because my computer's still booting up, but I can give you card messages. Darling, look at this. There's a new thing. Now that we're focused, yes, do you see it? A brand new exciting thing. Derek, let's hear about it. Derek, here's your message from the 80s. Don't have a cow, dude. You will do just fine. 
If you resonate with the name Derek, here's your message from the tarot. Mm. Derek, we have the Emperor in the Six of Cups coming in. All right. So we have a gentle person. This is somebody from your past life. This is a fun person. Somebody that may, uh, if somebody has problems, an emperor may have problems at night. Uh, they may stay busy all throughout the day. This person may have, uh, I hear a big brain. They may have a big brain. And sometimes when the emperor, yeah, is done with all their different jobs they do. Yeah, because the emperor does a lot. Then at night, they say, oh my gosh, my my worrying brain has to slow down. Yeah, I'm kind of stuck. I don't like the night. Yeah. So Spirit might have sent in a Six of Cups relationship. So the Six of Cups, we hear clever. The Six of Cups is somebody from your past or a past life. This is a fun person, somebody who gets your inner child all excited. All right. I hear you want to have a sleepover? I do want to have a sleepover. Is she going to bring her ladies cleaver? Maybe. Wonderful. Okay. Yeah, we're looking for an old-fashioned modern girl. Huh? I love and approve of myself. And the messages from the Divine Feminine Showgirls for Derek. Message from Divine Feminine Showgirls. Derek, you might get a Divine Feminine Showgirl in your life. <laughs> we have union. And right there, woo, my computer lit up. Yeah, a bunch of people are ascending up in vibration. It's 5.59. Yep. One more minute, it'll be six on the nut. <laughs> I'm getting I'm getting my YouTube up right now so I can give Derek your starseed transmissions. Let's just hang out for a minute. Should we see what else the tarot has to show Derek? What else does the tarot have to show Derek? If you resonate with the name of Derek. Here we go. Oh, darling, we have the Four of Coins. Somebody may get a new pan. Yeah, I got a frying pan. Oh, my God, the hackers just, I was just pulling up. Like, my YouTube was just coming up, and the hackers shut my computer down again. Yeah, I've mastered rage. I have. They just come in and do whatever they want. Yeah, I'm looking for somebody to help expose who the fuck this is. Yeah, but back to business. Yeah. Mm, my local grocery store a while back did these stamp things. Yeah, you collect stamps. Every 10 bucks you spent, you got a stamp. Yeah, I earned a free pan. I turned my stamps in for a free pan. Somebody might use a coupon, a stamp, a something or other. Somebody may... Find somebody who knows how to, mm hmm knows how to have caviar dreams on a beer budget. Wonderful. Okay. Here's your message, Derek. All right. We're just going to do cards. Who's next? Oh, darling. Yes, you too. A brand new exciting thing. Let's hear. In Arizona. Arizona? Well, let's hear about it. If you resonate with Arizona, here's your message. We have strength coming in. Leo energy. All right. take the reins somebody may hire someone they might have found exactly who they want all right somebody may come in fast somebody absolutely caught 
somebody's eye. All right. You're going to go from somebody who doesn't know what they're going to do to somebody who totally knows what to do. Okay, let's hear more. Message for Arizona. Arizona. I forgive myself for all the mistakes I've made. Message from Divine Feminine Showgirls. I picked up the deck and this stayed down. Gentleness. Hello, darling. What a beautiful veil. Let's hear more. I heard marriage proposal. Let's hear more. I hear master of ceremonies. Dream. Somebody may have had a dream with someone. Somebody may be connecting an astral. Somebody may have had a nice dream. Okay, let's hear more. Arizona. I got it on video. Somebody may have seen definitive proof of something. There's no denying it anymore. Yeah. I have mother freaking hackers. <laughs> okay. It's true. Yeah, my last my last video too where I'm wearing my peach moo moo. Uh just recently. Yeah, they are they put me through the filter. It's like a squirrel filter or a rabbit filter or something where my cheeks kind of puff out. Yeah. And then they edit my teeth. So it looks like two squirrel teeth or bunny teeth that kind of go up. And then these teeth, they shorten. Yeah. They put me through some kind of filter. Yeah. I don't approve of that. No, somebody has literally hijacked my work. And I've been begging for like years for my work back. Mm hmm So I can't wait to find out who this is. Yeah. All right. So there's that. Next. Yeah, they hit again. Psycho Witches struck again. Yeah. I just watched it this morning. Oh. I'll take I'll try to take some screenshots. Sometimes I, I have screenshots of when they do that. They edit my teeth. Um and I'll I have some from the past. I'll try to find, I'll try to take some on this last one. And uh, if anybody is interested in checking out what I'm talking about, YouTube is totally hackable. It is. I've been getting hacked for years. Other readers get hacked. Yeah. My, I was getting 2,500 views per reading until the hacker hid me. Now I get like 37. Yeah, and they fuck with my teeth. Yeah, so I can't wait to find out who the fuck this is. All right, so that's that. Yeah, somebody might find out, yeah, exactly who's been fucking with them. Aha! The sun, the happiest card in the deck. Aha! Where are we gonna go? New York, New York. If you resonate with New York, here's your message from Divine Feminine Showgirls. New York. Okay, so here's my computer. It's all up. I'm getting ready. Thought. I'm pulling up YouTube now. New York. Message found. For New York. Hmm. Darling, then off to Paris! Oh my dear! Adventure. Somebody may be traveling around. A, uh, a passport might mean something. I see stamps in a passport. New York. If you guys meet with New York. 
There's a great reason this is unfolding before me now. Look at that's the same image that came out here. I love and improve myself. Is somebody making art? Wonderful. Message from the 80s. I'm just gonna get YouTube up. Okay. Stick it to the man, man. Alright, let's hear more. Message from the 80s for New York. Darling, remove the false mask. And messages, oh, YouTube is up. Messages from the Scorpio Sea Tarot. Whoa! We've got the Chariot and the Three of Cups. Somebody may pick someone up for a date. Somebody may uh, may have had a veil removed. Somebody may, mm-hmm. I mean, mm-hmm. I hear Miriam. I hear Myriad. All right. Somebody may go in somebody's um, camper, in somebody's van, somebody's large vehicle, something like that. It's usually a private thing. Somebody can't stop thinking about it. They may have ascended in vibration. Spirit may have removed blinders so they see exactly. Yeah. Okay, I hear. My birds are like flapping in there. Yeah. Somebody may have ascended in vibration. Yeah, and I hear. Think about who didn't show up and who should have been there. Okay, Cancerian energy with the chariot. All right, dudes, here we go. We've got transmissions ready. So we have Derek, Arizona, and New York. Derek, if you resonate with Derek, here's your message. Derek, you go down to DE, Delaware might mean something. All signs. Got a metal rock detector now, grooving hearts. Aquarius, Virgo, and Gemini energy says heartbreak, betrayal, delay, the apology. Pisces energy says pictures and a deal with the arrow master. All signs. Captain, we have a short delay, then ready to spice things up with their muse. Sagittarius and Capricorn energy. Another boys club deleted the Supreme Empress again. Star seeds, the tarot DJ. Yeah, I see. Mm hmm. A photo shoot. Yeah. It's with legs. <laughs> I see um, somebody sitting on a paper moon. Mm -hmm. Okay. An old fashioned photo shoot might mean something. All right. There you go, Derek. Arizona. If you resonate with Arizona. Arizona, you go down to Ari, A-R-I. Arizona or Ari. Aries and Libra energy says perfect timing for romance. Aries, Aquarius, and Scorpio energy come in with gratitude, understanding, and trust. Gemini, Pisces, and Aries energy say trust the winged wise ones. Aries energy says here comes authentic friendship. Time to trust. And Aries and Virgo energy says guilt motivated them to try again. York. Wonderful. We're going to do new. Virgo, here's your new beginning. Cancer, backstab like a mofo brings in new leadership. Cancer and Virgo, drama, times two. Go with the new person. Gemini, Sagittarius, Pisces, Cancer, and Aquarius. New vibration brings in true love. 
all signs Scorpio energy. Out with the old, in with the new. Now we're going to do York. A Yorkie might mean something, or a little dog. York goes down to Y-O-R. All signs. Guess where I am? In your old tub. There's your message, New York. <laughs> next. Who's next? Oh my darling. Yeah, what happened? Nicole, oh my, yeah, but, uh, yeah. Did somebody, somebody got something totally wrong. Okay. Yeah, E, E might mean something. Nicole, let's hear about it. If you resonate with the name Nicole. I hear pale, pale blue, I, I saw Nico, and then I heard pale blue eyes. The Velvet Underground might mean something. Nick, N-I-C. All signs, nice velvet, just go for it. Scorpio Energy says, nice crib, what's up with the doppelganger? Pisces, Leo, and Scorpio Energy say, a nice pair of yams. And Aries and Taurus Energy say, be nice to work. Word nerds, okay, be nice to nerds. Word nerds might mean something. <laughs> Somebody may like to play a your Sudoku or however you say that. I've never played that. Like, oh, now I see a word search. Somebody might have one of those booklets, activity books or something. Now I see those when I was a kid. Oh, I love those. Yeah, you had this magic marker thing that only worked on that kind of book and you'd You'd do like little games and stuff, and you'd have to use that special marker. Aries and Taurus, be nice to nerds. Word up, lazy boy. You'll end up working for them. All right, Nicole, here's your message. Do you guys name Nicole, Nico, or Nick? I'd totally wear your button, babe. Somebody likes someone's style. Okay. Message from Divine Feminine Showgirls for Nicole, Nico, or Nick. Nicole, Nico, or Nick. Are we at peace here, darling? Nicole, Nico, or Nick. Message for Nicole, Nico, or Nick. Corsage, a wrist corsage might mean something. A river of compassion washes away my anger and replaces it with love. I hear river. Okay, I'm going to type river in. If you resonate with river, here's your message. Aries and Pisces energy comes in with, Owl brings in river of compassion. All signs. Riverboat gamblers vouched. Affirmative. Tis really happened. Leo and Libra energy says, by the river, I saw it happen. Sagittarius energy says, West River Club. Serenade from spirit. Mid-century modern. Send love arrow. Capricorn energy says, life purpose down by the river. Back from the dead. All right. River or Nicole or Nick or Nico, here's your message. We have the Page of Swords and the Ten of Cups. We have a shy person who's been watching for a very long time. This is somebody who likes to learn. Okay, I might have said Ten of Cups, Ten of Coins. Yeah, they saw everything they, they're looking for. Their dream person. They want to live with this person. Okay, this might be a shy person. This is my card for a studious, shy person. Very intelligent. Somebody may have a teenager, a preteen, something like that. All right, there's your message. Nicole, Nick, Nico, and River. Next. Oh, darling, we're manifesting now. When the magician shows up, that means... Somebody's learned exactly what they 
they need to bring something to fruition. So you've earned all the aces. If you see on the magician's table there, they got the ace of cups, the ace of pentacles, the ace of, ace of swords right there, and they're holding the ace of wands. Yeah, they're about to manifest. What? Chet! Oh my God, did somebody make the dream person? Did they make it? Don't, don't hate me because I'm beautiful. Oh my God, Chet! Somebody's about to see, yeah. Okay, and yeah, I see Chet from Weird Science. <laughs> He's like opening the door. <laughs> yeah, I see that scene. I'll link that scene down in the comments. Somebody might be have a brother in the military, something like that. All right. Chet, you go to C-H-E. All signs. Voted most popular. Hacker, cheater, exposed, update. Leo Energy says, here comes their chess queen. Are you queenie? Here comes their chess queen. Are you queenie? I hear catalog. I hear country, country bumpkin. I hear kelp forest. The kelp forest in the water has otters swimming in and out of it. All signs, check out the popcorn party. All signs, checked it out twice. Now we're in love. All signs, say cheese. The cutest vampire is in town. Yeah. Weird science have it. Yeah, somebody, yeah, they manifested their dream girl. Yeah. And their brother may see them get their dream girl. Oh my God. Let's hear more. Oh yes, Chet. If you resonate with Chet or C-H-E. We have the King of Wands here. All right, this is my card for somebody's spirit guide is helping this come to fruition. So we have mm -hmm, ancestral guides helping this king of wands. They found all sorts of passion. Okay, let's hear more. So a lot of times if you put out to the universe, this is, the, this is what I want, this is what I'm looking for. I don't settle for less, yeah. Uh, then spirit will say, okay, they'll give you little tests. Yeah, I see the flowers on the side of the, the path. All right. Somebody mm -hmm, may have spent some time uh, picking flowers. So the flowers on the side of the path, they are the host keys. Yeah. Literally, like, leaning over into the path saying, pick me, pick me, pick me. Yeah, you don't have to try very hard. Pick me, pull all of my petals off. Love me, don't love me, love me, don't love me, love me. Do you love me? Pick me. Yeah, you don't have to try very hard. Just pick me. Yeah. Oh, oh, you don't love me? No, all my petals are off. Yeah. And you've just dropped me and you've just picked another. Pick me. Pick me! Yeah. Pick mm, mm, mm. Yeah. Groupies might mean something. Something like that. Yeah. You're never going to find an Empress energy in a pick me type of girl. Yeah, because the Empress is not leaning into the path begging someone to pick them because they're embarrassingly codependent. No, the Empress is off the path. She's over under a tree somewhere. She's a lady slipper, an orchid that's growing. Yeah. And for someone to find her, they have to leave the path and actually go look for somebody as special as she is. That's when you know you have an emperor. Yeah, and guess what? Where I live in Minnesota, the lady slipper is our state flower. Yeah, it's illegal to pick it. You can't just pick it and kill it right away. No. That's the Empress. Yeah. All right. Holy cow. 
Yeah, I'd rather be with you than the Hoskies. This is my carb for uh, a bunch of, yeah, a bunch of low vibers that uh, picked on, made fun of somebody. And this is the carb for the dream person. So these are the pick me, pick me, pick me. And this is the Empress. All right, Chet. Message from Chet. For Chet or C-A-T. Does somebody have a bra on their head? Oh my darling. <laughs> I ask my loved ones to support my dreams. Somebody may have talked to a sibling. Paint may mean something. All right, message from the Divine Feminine Silk Girl. Divine Feminine Silk Girl. We may have somebody who's used to having uh, having things kind of come to them easily. They may not have had to try real hard in the past to get a date due to their career, uh, some status, something like that. Yeah. But they've realized these low-hanging fruit, these hose keys, are not exciting. All right. What you looking at, darling? Somebody may like someone's neck. Okay, let's hear more. Do you want a neck? Somebody wants to neck. Oh my God. Let's hear more. Message for Chet or C-H-E? Psych! Okay, let's see what's on the back. That view is dope, motel. Somebody may want to go on vacation with someone, get to know somebody, spend some time by the water or by a resort or something like that. A palm tree might mean something. I hear, I'm feeling blue. All right, there's your message. Chet or C-H-E are those who created their dream girl. <laughs> you can take the bra off your head. It's true, you can. <laughs> Black cat butthole, ain't it the shit? Yep, bad luck's about to leave your life. Brian, are you ready? If you resonate with the name Brian, here's your message. Brian, you go to Bri, B-R-I. Cancer energy comes in with backstab like a mofo, brings in new leadership. Sagittarius and Aquarius energy say fearless freedom brings forth the date. Gemini and Sagittarius energy come in with Pisces, Cancer, and Aquarius energy. New vibration brings in true love. Scorpio and Pisces energy says bring your film Crow's crew, we're taking pictures now. And Sagittarius energy says, helpful people bring trust in new career. All right, if you resonate with Brian, here's your message. Or Bri, Bree, Bri, Brian, or Bree. We have the Ten of Wands. This is my card for somebody who's going to move. All right. Message from Creativity of Life for Brian or Bree or Bri. I forgive those who have harmed me in my past and peacefully detach from them. Somebody may move. They may move to a new city. I know my wisdom guides me to the right decision. Okay, message from Divine Feminine Showgirls for Brian. Brian, pop on your own. Or Bree, or Bri. We have a Gardney. Mm -hmm. I hear Guardy. I hear LaGuardia. We have a Guardian Angel here, darling.
All right, let's hear more. I hear hyacinth. I just heard hyacinth. No shit, Sherlock. All right, somebody may be getting nervous. Stick it to the man, man. Okay, let's hear more. Hmm. Smooth move. Out of here. And let's roll. Yeah, I see the sexy roller skating girls. Yeah, if you resonate with this, make sure to check the comment section. Like anyone. Yeah, because it's time for the sexy roller skating girls. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you don't like the sexy roller skating girls, there's something seriously wrong with your vibration. They're going to help us all ascend up this morning. All right, darlings, that's your soul school homework. Mandatory. Watch the sexy roller skating girls. They're going to help us all stay alive today. All right, peace out. Love ya.